third and four empty backfield. Willis puts it up top for the tight end. Austin Hooper incomplete. And no flag is thrown. It will be fourth down. Trent McDuffie is back in the lineup. But it's first round pick out of Washington. Playing football. And now whoever gets the ball is whoever should get the ball. It's Ingram with the ball for the Jags for a first down. Pending the penalty marker, the ball came out. You'll see that more in this half. Here's a second and five. Over to Agnew. Yeah, and they back him up. It's McDuffie. Back last week from IR. Today they have. Here's a second and seven. Say Jones. Tries to split him. And he gets hammered down by McDuffie. But these crucial situations. Lawrence is looking his way. He's going deep for Jones. Oh, and it's in and out of his hands. No flag. McDuffie with the coverage. Their first round pick out of Washington right there with him. Yeah, Knight really thought he started the year off really well. He's got some speed. You see the hand in there, but that's great timing. Deep ball, Marvin Jones. They say no contact. It's McDuffie again on the coverage down the field. Remember before he was on Zay Jones, this time on Marvin Jones. So patient, watch this. The patience to get right there and then trust your speed and then block him off, almost make him go to the sideline. This kid is going to be really good. They Targeted three times, he's caught two. Austin Eckler to the left, he gains three. Chiefs show blitz, they come with it. Perkins in trouble, comes near side, and it's incomplete. He tried to get it to Lance McCutcheon. Pretty good coverage by Trent McDuffie. And he's first down, pressure. Perkins hits, uh, ball's incomplete. Ball was there on the hands of Lance McCutcheon, just could not finish the catch, second and 10. The chase, oh, he's out of bounds. It's a really good job by McDuffie, one-on-one -on -one of closing off. Now he's a good coach, all out. Second and 13, there's Chase. McDuffie on his back, slings him down at the 14. That's a good tackle right there. I mean, Chase is going to win one-on-one. -on -one. McDuffie's... Right, Wilson escapes for a moment, throws a wobbler. Incomplete. He's trying to push that one to Brandon Johnson. Now it's fourth down. Vegas. Moving pocket. Wilson. And he just threw it away. Run, timely completions. They stick with the run on first down. Walker bouncing it to the outside. There he goes. And Walker hit hard by Metcalf. He's got to come alive. Smith sets, looking that direction, finds Treadwell instead, and Treadwell stopped short. Trent McDuffie. Hey. And that ball kind of brought him back, but he's that ball's got to be thrown all the way to the sidelines. You're kind of tapping your toes as, before you go out of bounds, and you just cut that ball off from flying out of bounds. But he had to come back for that football a little. Edmonds goes in motion. Wilson throwing to the near side of the field. The catch is made by Judy and Judy. Out of bounds, wrestled out of bounds by Trent McDuffie. Wilson under pressure. He got mm. hit from behind. The ball is loose. Oh, just a well-timed, well-designed blitz from Steve Spagnolo, the defensive coordinator, and it does appear like McDuffie was able to get that ball out before Russell Wilson's arm was coming forward. That was a 12-yard pickup, and now Wilson to throw. Has time, now throws off the Ooh. hands of his intended oh receiver, Kendall Hinton. Passable behind him. Well, it's hard to it's hard to know exactly what to blame here because this is zone coverage, and Hinton should have sat it down. Standard I want to play to. I want to do different things in this league. I want to be around for a long time. Stidham throwing should have been intercepted. Trent McDuffie had it in his hands. Should have been a second interception for Jared Stidham. 24. Here is Agnew. Zay Jones could not get the block. That is some play by some kind of player. 
Lawrence going towards Marvin Jones goes up incomplete. Two there to defend the Brian Cook and Trent McDuffie two rookies and just trying to throw it up to Marvin Jones who's been really good on those contested catches he led this team with 10 contested catches you saw the vertical mm. not quite enough. Wow. First plays over to Chase. And Jamar Chase is tackled in a hurry by the rookie, Trent McDuffie. The last two matchups between these two, an identical final score. And that pass is almost picked off. That was McDuffie, who was three or four yards in front of Chase. And he got both hands on it. You saw the play right before this where they threw it inside, and this is where you play. Ooh, and that was very close. Over to Chase. The action to Chase today has been really these quick conversion on third and 14 in the first half. This is third and 17. Burrows on the run at the line of scrimmage, gets the pass away, and it's incomplete. Ames come down to a player making a play. Watch this by McDuffie. That's going to be a first down. It's a perfectly thrown ball and just tips it to where the ball's going to look and get off target. But McDuffie, a first rounder who has showed up today as well. Oh. Having won the championship game. Third and five, down seven. It's P. Ryan. Tacklers are there, and the Chiefs defense comes up big after the turnover to close out quarter number three. Sanders dancing around. Trying to look for a seam that's just done there. Strung out and played well by Kansas City. And that's a good start against his team. We told from so many others. Late blitz coming over the middle. A quick throw to completion. Devontae Smith for a short game is going to get up to the 30. Hurts has time. Gets over the middle to Gainwell, who gets hit immediately by McDuffie. Now the Eagles have to use their final timeout and likely attempt a field goal here. They'll do 